so the whole point of me talking to you in the car is because, well, for number one, I'm in a rush to get up to my dad's house to see him today because it's today's only day I can go see him with work and whatnot. So I'm in a hurry, I'm driving, and this is the only time I have to talk, but I really want to talk about it because it happened yesterday. There was a post about on the New York Times by some woman, I forget her name. She was writing a little article, this is only a page long, about this new show called Heroes of Cosplay. And she was doing a little run over talking about cosplay in general and it really was kind of rude to all cosplayers calling us crazy and comparing us to Civil War reenactors and I was like, that is nothing the same. Civil War reenactors are reenacting real live history events. We're having fun dressing up as heroes or supervillains and cosplay anime characters. I just thought I was kind of insulting lumping all cosplayers together, um, how expensive our costumes are, how we have costumes made, and how we are literally trying to become the characters we're playing. I was like, that's really not cosplay at all. Like, everyone's dressed up on Halloween, right? It's the same thing, and no one ever gives you crap about dressing up for Halloween, but if you do it at a comic convention, all hell breaks loose. And there was a really good rebuttal article. It was put out by New Times. Some, some Miami online newspaper. And it ex explained exactly what I'm explaining, that this woman was really out of her place talking about cosplay like that. Number one, because it didn't really look like she did any research about the subject at all, she just wrote a post about her personal thoughts, which I guess is okay, but it was kind of mean to everyone in the cosplay field. And I understand we live in this little world that most people don't indulge in, but still, that doesn't mean you can be mean to people. So, moral of the story is just always do what you want because people are always going to badmouth you. And to all those people who do the badmouthing, please do your research first before you just start harassing the entire group of people because we are all friends even though we don't know each other and we will stick up for each other. So, watch yourself. So, the links for both articles are in the description below. Please read them both and let me know what you think. Be nice. I mean, I'm sure the lady didn't mean any harm. It was just something that kind of made us cosplayers upset. So we're sticking up for each other. All I'm going to say is haters going to hate and they're always going to hate. So we're driving. And this is not going to work. Oh, speed bump. Oh, no. Oh, stay it up. Yeah. Oop. You ran the red light, mister. I see you. Yeah, you skid marks. Get out of here. I'm turning the corner. Oh, that's a Star Wars air freshener hanging out. Come on, get back up. 